the sworn, eternal, uncompromising enemy of the liquor traffic. I ask no quarter and I give none. What means this assault against the 18th Amendment? Oh, it's nothing under heaven but an attempt to bind and rivet the old breweries and the old distilleries around the neck of the American people for their own profit. Ah, but where will the money come from? They say that Uncle Sam will pay, they'll pay Uncle Sam one billion five hundred million dollars in revenue. Well, where will it come from? Come from the pocket of the poor devil that drinks the stuff in the world. They say we need their saloons in order to bring back prosperity. Well, what does Germany need in France and England to bring prosperity? Why don't they pay us what they owe us? They say, well, prohibition has brought on the depression. Well, what's brought it on the world? Or depression is worldwide. The saloons are dead as an Egyptian mummy. She's too dead to skin. But her ghost hangs like a moral paralysis over our land. But no man, woman, or child alive today will ever live to see the stars and stripes wave over an open licensed saloon in the United States and of America. I'll fight the saloon from Hawaii to Hoboken. I'll kick it as long as I have a foot. I'll punch it as long as I have a fist. I'll butt it as long as I have a head. I'll bite it as long as I have a tooth, and when I'm old and fistless and footless and toothless, I'll gull it till I go home to heaven and it goes home, my friend, to hell. <laughs>